This is Charmaine from Sky DJ Agency and today I'm going to share with you a tool that Facebook has developed to help you understand how much tax you should be having in your Facebook ads and in your Facebook post. So first and foremost, just go to google.com.sg and search for Facebook Tax Overlay Tool. And once you have searched on that, just take note not to click on anything that says Add go to the first organic results that has no ads and it's by Facebook. Look at the URL. It's www.facebook.com slash ads slash tools slash tax underscore overlay. This is the tool that you want to look on so that you can have a look at what Facebook has to offer um, you and I who are advertising on Facebook or posting on Facebook for our businesses or even for our own Facebook page and so on. You can see here on the right is image tax rating. So what you want to do is to aim for image tax OK so that your ads will run normally. Image tax low sometimes, um, say for example, if uh, you put in $10, you could have reached 5,000 people. Uh, because the image tax is low, you may have reached like maybe 2,500 to 3,500 people. So it's uh, substantially lower than what you could have um, reach uh, the amount of people so if anything if you really need to have tax in your graphics um, just maximum you should just reach uh, low after low like image tax medium uh, you're gonna reach like just a few hundred people with a ten dollar budget instead of a few thousand people and for image tax high your tax will not run at all so I'm just gonna give you an example here on how uh, Facebook does this so right now I'm gonna show you uh, two ads that we have the first ad is this, email marketing with MailChimp. And I'm going to click OK and it's going to upload. And let's look at the results. It says image text low, which means that there's a, there's a chance that fewer people will see. Okay, um, you, you may reach, you may not. Uh, it, sometimes it works, sometimes uh, you, you are just reaching much lesser people. So consider reducing the text in your graphics. But for example, say we are unable to reduce the text much further. So I would recommend that you can try it, but if you are just um, reaching a few hundred people with a $10 budget, then that's not how it should be. You may want to kind of like improve on your graphic or um, see how you can um, work on this. The, the, the thing about our logo is that it's read as words as well, Sky Digital Agency, which means that, you know, we can't really help it unless we kind of like remove the entire uh, logo as a whole. The other graphic that I'm going to show you right now is a Facebook ad that we have done for our SEO and SEM workshop. And it says that image text okay, your ad will run normally. So this is what you want uh, as a result uh, for your ads. So or your even your organic posts, because when you do not add so much text in your graphics, um, Facebook actually pushes this out to um, more people uh, within the same budget. They're trying to kind of like um, have some quality over the ads that are running on their platform. So this is something that you need to take note of. So if you are interested in joining us for our workshop, we have many courses that are SkillsFuture approved um, from Facebook marketing to email marketing to SEO and SEM to Google Analytics that we launched next year. So look out for our space. If you like more of our videos, do subscribe um, to us on YouTube. Here's our link in the description uh, as well. We look forward to seeing you at our workshops.